Today we are at the spectrum, testing everyday citizens on the knowledge of the country they live in. How many people are in the U.S. House of Representatives? Uh, yeah, 492. I'm sorry, the answer is B-435. So I don't yeah. know exactly, but I'll guess 435. That is correct. <laughs> Thank you. How many people are in the, ho in the U.S. House of Representatives? Uh, I think it's 470. Not too sure, though. Oh. Uh, I'm afraid the answer is B-435. Ah, oh, it's close. I think it's A, 470. That is incorrect. It's 435. <laughs> Which of the following documents contains the following quote? We the people, in order to form a more perfect union, establish justice, ensure domestic tranquility, is... No. B. No. B. B, the Magna Carta? No, it's Constitution. <laughs> I think it should be... Declaration of Independence? I'm afraid it's C, the Constitution. We the people, in order to form a more perfect union, establish justice, ensure domestic tranquility. Well, let's see. Constitution. Ay, 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 I'm bad. Right. Okay. Um, which of the following documents contains the following quote, We the people, in order to form a more perfect union, establish justice, and ensure domestic tranquility? Hmm. B. Carta Magna? I'm afraid the answer is C. Constitution. <laughs> um, I go with the Declaration of Independence. Is it C? That is correct. Nice. <laughs> Keep quiet. <laughs> if the U.S. president decides to veto a bill, how many veto how many votes are required by the Senate to disregard the president's veto? Isn't it 67 two-thirds vote? Yeah, that's correct. Uh, is it? I'm it that's a lot of votes. Wait, how many votes total? Uh, uh, I don't know. I'll go ahead and see. See? Oh, no. That's correct. Okay. Oh. <laughs> I don't know. To disregard that president's veto. Uh, I believe it's, I think it's two thirds, so that would be. Well, like, I don't know, there's 100 in the Senate, so somewhere in the 60s or 70s. Yes. There's 67. Oh, this, yeah, it's, it's correct. Which, which okay. number are we on? Uh, number 8. Number 8. Oh, on the backs. Sorry. 76. I'm going to guess 76. Um, no, I'm afraid that's wrong. Uh, the three branches of government are... C. Executive, legislative, and judicial. Yes, that's correct. I think it's B. B or C. Executive, executive. legislative, and judicial. Branch. I think it's C. I think it's C. That is correct. Okay. <laughs> I think it's C. And judicial. That's correct. Garrett, freedom of speech is guaranteed in America because of the First Amendment, Second Amendment, Thirteenth Amendment, or I don't know. First Amendment? That is correct. Freedom of speech is guaranteed in America by which amendment? A, First Amendment. That's correct. Freedom of speech is guaranteed in America because of the First Amendment. Correct. C. Correct. Which country borders Iraq? Um. I want to say Lebanon. I'm afraid the answer is A. Syria. And what country borders Iraq? Uh, Iran. Saudi Arabia, I think. Uh, you can look at the options. Oh, there's... I want to say Yemen? I'm afraid it's Syria. Syria, okay. Syria, Lebanon, Yemen, or I don't know. Syria? That's correct. It's alright.
Um, what country borders Iraq? Syria. How many members are in the House of Representatives as of 2012 in the United States of America? A. <laughs> no, it's actually 435. How long is a U.S. Senator term? Six years, I think. Yes, that's correct. This is advanced stuff. How long is a U.S. Senator's term as of 2012? Six years, four years, or two years? Two. Um. Um. Senator? I don't know. Wait, 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 that's the simple answer. Um. Is it B, four years? No. <laughs> How many continents are in the world? Seven. Continent uh, seven. Correct. Five. I, she got, I know my history. Three.